What up, it's your boy, Incredible Man. And yes, I am back at it again. And this is Full Dive. This ultimate next-gen full dive RPG is even worse than real life. Every week I say I'm going to shorten down the title, but I kind of like saying the title as is, so I may stick to that for now anyway. Um, this is episode four, so let's dive into it and see what's popping off, man. I don't think I do it good, no, I think I do it great. They would do it if they could, they can't do it, so they hate. Everybody want to look, but nobody want to play. Stealing eyes. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Yeah, we saw the ghost, him being tortured, him wetting himself, getting free, and immediately logging out. <laughs> that man said, screw this game. It sucks, man. Who idea was this? Like, can you still feel the sensation? Oh, he didn't pee himself in real life. Wow. Episode four, the only one to beat the game. So he's going to find the other dude that beat the game, right? Oh, we're going to find out what happened. Wow. Oh, so his sister even like liked him back then. So what in the world happened for his sister to hate him and, and all these other people kind of look down on him? Oh, I bet he messed up the race or something, man. Oh, he might mess up then. Oh, wow. Maybe he cracked under pressure or something, man. Like a uh, uh, old dude from Free. Oh, he's nervous, man. What in the world? Is that a scout? Okay. So he was a famous runner. Oh, an Olympic runner. Oh, wow. Dude, don't don't get, don't get nervous, man. Oh, they putting pressure on him. Did he did he did he intentionally put that pressure on him? So it messed him up now. I admit I used to get nervous before uh cross country meets too though, man. Like I normally don't get nervous, but it's just something about that like you know, that whole group of people running with you. Like like when you running beside somebody or something like that, it all you always tend to get a little nervous. Oh, what what did he do though? What happened? Oh. Is he going to fall face first?
Oh, wow. He had a late start. Oh, he had, he failed. So he cracked under the pressure. Oh man, that sucks. He wet himself, no! He never went to the bathroom. He never went to the bathroom because the dude talked to him. And then they laughing at him. Come on, man. Dude, that's, oh, that's all kinds of embarrassing, man. No wonder he don't want to run track no more. You know what? I'd be like him, man. You know what? Screw track. Screw y'all. Because y'all was laughing. Y'all ain't. Oh, that's messed up, man. Because that dude talked to him and he didn't get a chance to go to the bathroom. Well, he can't help but let it get to it, man. I don't care who you are. That's. Oh, that's why he, she treats him the way that he do now because. That's why she treats him like that now because of the way he treated her. Wow. The way you treated your sister, man. So he feel that way about everything because everybody that was cheering for him and happy turned on him the moment he tripped and fell and wet his pants. Wow. But you got to admit, because the Michael son went and talked to him, he didn't get a chance to go to the restroom. So now we see their relationship and why it's strained like that. <laughs> but she don't want to see him quit oh wow Oh, she don't want him to be a quitter. Wow.
Yeah, because, dude, you got to admit, man, you straight bashed her after that running accident when she was trying to just be there for you, man. I, I get where he's coming from. I mean, you, you know, like, dude, messing yourself in public is an embarrassing feat, man. Wow, so he, he's having a rough time at everything, man. And maybe he just decided to give up. Wow. So maybe he needs to play the game again. And maybe it'll help him in real life as well. Because he's going through some major problems in real life. To give you back that crappy game for one. Uh oh. Oh, he ain't joking. He dead serious. Listen to his tone. So he's a little traumatized because he peed himself in the game and it relates back to what happened to him in real life. Well, see, she's laughing. Oh... Uh... It was the first for me too. <laughs> oh, she could join this party. That'd be nice. <laughs> Is this the dude that cleared the whole game? I told you, like, you can learn lessons from this game. The one that beat the game. So I told you, there's a lesson to be learned from this game, if you can handle it. She, she said crap. She said this crap. She said crap. <laughs> you were finna call it a crappy game too. He's really, he's really not. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with a walkthrough because like particular quests and games are hard. So if there's someone that beat it already, that can help you with it. There's nothing wrong with that.
Hey, trash. <laughs> Yeah, I lost interest already. Oh, wow. She's going to insult me the whole time. You know what? I'm already disinterested, man. So you, yeah, yeah. If you train in real life, you can actually see that pay off in the game. Oh, dang. So he had to play through multiple playthroughs. <laughs> oh, wow. So you're going to have to level up in real life, man. Well, that makes sense. I'm trying to think. All these insults. But no, you just have to remember the phrase under the tree, right? <laughs> oh yeah the game is super realistic <laughs> Wow. Well, she just wants him to play again, though, but why? Well, I mean, that can't be the only reason, right? Well, let me go and clear this game real fast. Like, I'm going to be 100%. <laughs> <laughs> Don't try to bait me. Don't try to bait me. <laughs> where, 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 where will you put it that way? <laughs> Hi. She just wanted to log into the freaking game. Don't fall for it, man. And he logged in anyway. <laughs> man, keep your distance. <laughs> You better go somewhere.
Okay, okay. This is this, that that's nasty. <laughs> this this man he's so he's <laughs> it was a lot of time was wasted persuading you. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Yeah, but if you can clear it though, dude, you'll be one of what? Two people to actually clear the game? Everybody else gave up. Oh, dang, man. Okay. Uh, I kind of wish we had more. That episode went by way too fast for me, man. Like, we got all the information about Hero's former life and, you know, what happened at the track meet that he wet himself then and that led to him kind of freaking out during the game when he wet himself. So we got the backstory and we see that real life sucks for him. So the game sucks as well. So like now you like I get the comparison from the title and everything, but I got to admit to find out that the dude that beat it also made like a, a guide to assist not so much as help because he didn't really give quite a bunch of useful information but it was enough to assist to get him back to playing the game and i feel like that's that's not bad because like it don't give you it don't tell you how to do it but it gives you hints alone to like oh okay well you still got to figure it out yourself and i feel like that may be a little better than an actual guide that just kind of breaks it down. okay well you do this 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 and this and then you get this oh okay cool is that even fun to like to play the game that way to like have someone break it down for you? But now, like I mentioned throughout my reaction, I said like there's nothing wrong with a guy, but like this kind of guy is what I what I what I'm trying to get across. Like if it's something that gives you hints as to you still kind of got to figure it out yourself instead of actually just giving you everything that you need to complete this and then you get this weapon or unlock this and that. So I feel like a guide like that is so much better than actually just straight up spoiling it because then you don't have any fun playing the game. Now, this game, as of right now, it, it hasn't been fun at all. But it's interesting, to say the least. So I'm excited to see where they're going to go in the next episode because I feel like this episode was so short, man. We got the backstory. We got old girl persuading him to play the game again. We found out about the player that can actually that actually uh, completed the game and that he made a guidebook a little bit. So now we're back in the game, getting ready to play the game. So next week we'll dive into the game and we'll already be in the game. But I'm excited to see where it's going to go now because now he has his sight sets on actually defeating the game and conquering it because of what his sister said and talking to the shop owner. So now I'm excited to see where we're going to go. This is your boy, Incredible, man. Don't forget to smash the like button so you can't smash any more. Comment down below, and I'll be sure to respond to each and every one of them and subscribe, but only if you really want to, man. And remember, the anime matters, anime is greatness, and anime is life, man. Peace out.